Lord, we do thank you that we can gather around this table and share your meal with you. Thank you, Lord, that as believers, we can do this. Lord, again, we think of you as we, we share the bread and the wine. Thank you, O oh Lord, for everything you do for each and every one of us. Amen. Amen. And just going to say a few words. In Genesis 1, the Bible tells us God you. created the world and everything in it, and it was perfect. And I'm sure that each of us can think of things in this world that we have seen that God has created, that has made us stand and watch or listen in awe at the beauty of his creation. Jesus tells us in John 14, 2, in my father's house are many mansions. If it was not so, I would not have told you. I go and prepare a place for you. For us to go to heaven, to be in that mansion, first of all, Jesus had to die. He went to that cross at Calvary. It was there at Calvary that we could come and we could ask forgiveness of our sins. And he took all our sins upon himself. <clears throat> and that means that one day we can go to heaven. And I'm sure when we get there, it will be so glorious, so amazing, so wonderful a place. that Everything we've seen here on earth will pale in significance. And so we come to remember his death by joining together and sharing this communion time as one, his children. And we just give him praise. Thank you. Just a few verses from John 6. Then Jesus said to them, Most assuredly I say to you, Unless you eat of the flesh of the Son of Man and drink of the blood, you do not have life. Whoever eats my flesh and drinks my blood has eternal life, and I will raise him up on the last day. For my, blood, uh, for my flesh is food indeed, and my blood is drink indeed. He who eats my flesh and drinks my blood is a sight abides in me, and I in him. As the living Father sent me, I live because of the Father. So whoever feeds on me will live within me. And then just... Sorry. We just break this bread at this time. Jesus said at that Passover meal, think of me, think of my body as we break the bread. As we break this bread and share in him, we think of him. And likewise, he took the cup, this wine representing his blood. He said, drink, drink and remember me.
Thank you, Lord. Thank you that we can share in these symbols, this bread and this wine, your flesh, your blood. And Lord, we just again say thank you, remembrance of what you did for us. You died on that cross, but you rose again. And you rose again to give each and every one of us who believe in you everlasting life. And oh Lord, we thank you for that. Amen. Amen. Praise you.